Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to Rise of Cultures. We have ourselves a new event. It just began today. It's going to run a total of 22 days. This is the Pershing event, 2024. I think it's important to put the year in there because otherwise there might be some confusion since essentially they run the same event every year. Now, during the course of this event, you will have the opportunity to level one of two existing event buildings, the two Persian buildings. So these are our choices. We have the Persian Palace. And then, of course, we have the correct choice, the Mosaic Bath. Why is this the correct choice? Well, me, myself, I like military boosts. And this one gives military boosts. So leveling this one will actually give us more military boosts. So currently this one, I have it at level 11. Now it is two ages back. So I'm probably going to do a couple of age ups in this episode so that those trade items are more useful to me if they're more modern. Now, the other part of this event, of course, is that we're going to be earning currency here by doing missions. You can see I've already kind of advanced it a little bit. We're going to be spending them over here. No merging. So I won't be ignoring this event. So you can see I already have 9,250 of the currency. I hope we're going to be getting some more. And of course, what we can do is click these little guys down here for the chance of getting good rewards. Now, we can also multiply this to spend them more quickly, but we really don't have a lot of them right now. Of course, today's special is gears, and everybody knows I love my gears. I only spend them on gears. By the way, I do have a lot of gears, and there is a very specific legendary blueprint that is available. That is something else we're going to be looking into. So I'd like to first see how many of that currency we can get, and then we'll spend it, and then we'll be doing a lot of other things. Now, you might notice that the board is looking a bit busy at the moment. Uh, that's because during events, I really don't grab and use things because I might need them for missions. Now, in terms of where I am in the Iberian Age, let's just take a look. This is where I currently am. Now, I could complete this one right now. The thing is that these events frequently ask you to research a technology, so I kind of like to leave it there for now. But in terms of how far along, oh, let me get this out of the way. In terms of how far along I am, I think that gives you an idea. Because the last time we got together, I just entered this age. Now, unfortunately, the thing that I most want in military is very far down the line. Yeah, it's all the way over here because I want the heavies. I love my heavies. I have lots of boosts for them. Unfortunately, it's like all the way at the end here. Uh, yeah, we'll be in the Kingdom of Sicily you know, not too long after getting them. Although I have been having a lot of luck with military victories, and we're going to be doing one of those today. So let's see how much more we can get. And this is Shahrazad. Shahrazad says the same thing every year, so we're just going to skip right through this. I'm going to be doing the mosaic bath, so that's the one we're going to be advancing. Okay, and back down here. Like I said, the same thing every year. And I can do the mosaic bath again. That's what we're going to do. And I'm going to do the mosaic bath again. I'm getting a lot of research. These events are really good for research. Just saying. And now I have to wait. Whoa, one level. You know, I think I can actually do that. Yeah, I think we can do that. Let's just get back to that in a moment. All right, so pay coins. Yeah, we're just going to do that. Because it's an insignificant amount. Advancing. Win battle, solve negotiation. Let's just see what level is the negotiation. Eh, five items. I don't feel like doing them. Even if I have all these crazy wild cards, I don't feel like it. Win battle. The problem with winning the battle is I want to win a bigger battle, a nice two-wave one. So that's where we're going to call it for now. However, I think we can do something about this. Let me just open up my inventory for a moment and go down to items. Right, where is... Yeah, I have a lot of these tickets. There we go. That's the one I'm looking for. Yeah, that's going to be the mosaic bath. Okay, so we have a token for doing that now. As a matter of fact, since I'm here, 
Why don't we do some age ups? All right, hold on a minute. Where is my mosaic bath? Right here. Okay, that one is now up. Let's go again. And we're going to use this one. And we're going to age that up again. There we go. All right, let's pop in here. Yep, so we do have... Um, actually, that's the one before. But that's still okay. All right, we can unlock another worker. There we go. And we're going to get stuff. And we just advanced a mission. Right, so I'm going to get this little box and we're going to get another ticket there. Yep, we're going to get another ticket. So I could level it again. We'll just hold on to it for now. All right, now I have to get it up to 15. That really shouldn't be too much of a problem. All right, let's pop back over to the event. I have 11,650. Here's the thing. What I like to do is I like to do the five times, but only if the rewards are good. So we're going to get that chance for the 200 um, gears over here, if you look at it. The thing is, I don't like the rest of the options. So I want to spend as little as possible. So I'm going to do one over here just to basically get a new set of rewards. Okay, so what's in here now? Oh, that's much better. We can get some research. Now, I'm guessing that this is a random one, which means it'll probably be uh, Hercules. All right, we'll go do this one. All right, so this one here times five, and boom. I'm hoping for gears. And they run all the way back. Oh, okay, I got uh, Queenie over here. But I did get some good gears here, and I got some research. So that was uh, definitely worth it. Okay, so what do you got in here now? Oh, we can get some extra gear. It's only 50. The thing is, I don't have enough to even do five. What about you? Okay, that's another random one. What about this one way back here? I mean, it is research, but the problem is we only have a 5% chance. All right, here's what I'm going to do. Let's just do one of these. Close that up. Let's do one of these. All right, so I got one research out of that. But I wanted to get a new selection over here. Okay, that's a chance for 120. All right, so that's the one I'm going to do. But I'm only going to do one of them because I can't do a five. I want as many chances as I can to get that. Totally that. But I do want to have other options available. That's also okay. We can get research there. I am hoping for another 200 gears, though. So let's just do that. And I think that's the last one that I can do. Oh, wow. How about that for luck, huh? I can do one more. What do you got? 50. You know, I'm just going to do it anyway because we've been so lucky with this. Why not? I don't think I'm going to get another 200, but, you know... When you're winning at the slot machine, you have to keep pulling, right? Once you lose, you walk away. Okay, we're close to leveling this guy up. Okay, so I have spent all of the currency that I have for now. I'm going to save it all until I see gears return later in the event. So that is it for now. So essentially what you do, you're going to do the missions over here in order to earn the currency. And then you're going to go back over to the event to spend them. It's like I said, you want to make sure you're getting good rewards. See, that's not so bad because you're going to get research. Maybe you'll see something you like better. Not really. But the most important thing is the daily special. Now, I like gears. So whenever I see gears, that's where I want to spend everything that I have. There are the age up tokens like I used previously. And there's also mercenary commanders. But I have to say, if it's a random one, you don't want it. If it's a picket, that's different. Now, we did do some advancement over here on the lower right. So let's see if we can gather some stuff. We earned another ticket. So I'm going to take another ticket. And okay, and the next one is basically a skin. So that's another reason for earning the points so you can get all this stuff. Is this a picket? No, it's a random one. Uh, the one above is a picket. In other words, these are your options. You pick Genghis Khan.
That's what it comes down to. I mean, flat on the right is good, but Genghis Khan is the best. Absolutely. You want to get the currency so you can advance, get rewards, and then you can also get this. So what we're going to do now is I'm going to level up those buildings again. Let's go back over to the inventory. And where is the new ones? Persian. I got two of them. All right. We're going to do boom. Oh, sorry. We're going to do boom. And two of those. Claim. There we go. All right. And let's pop out. And back into here. Upgrade. Which one is this? Level 12? Yeah, that's we are on level 12. Upgrade. Okay, I'm not sure why it keeps closing them off like that. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on with it. There it is. Yeah, I was very confused. Oh, we're going to get a boost in our military. I love those boosts in my military. All right, let's go back in here. And there's another one. All right, so this is what I'm getting right now, and I have a 3.5% increase in damage, and of course, we picked up another worker as well. So it's 14. We're going to be able to advance this a lot more before this event is over. All right, so that's basically everything you need to know, except remember to keep things available. Have food available to grab onto. Keep your money sitting there, because later in the event, it might say something like, hey, Collect 2 million gold. And if you don't have gold sitting there, it's going to be a lot harder to do. And always keep your farms going because frequently it'll have things like collect from your farms. And these guys down here, I have a lot of these. It might say collect X amount of food. And these guys help with the money too. And always have these wonderful little incidents sitting there, even though those are the specific ones for the event. So it could have gotten me some more currency. I just don't think that would be enough to actually do the job. I will do the battle to advance it, but there's another battle I want to do first. And I think it's a good time to actually do that battle. Looking at the Iberian quests, you'll notice the top one here. By the way, that's El Cid. I have conquered seven of eight regions. Yes, my military is doing very well. Speaking of military, why don't we go take care of that business right now? This is El Cid, and if we look at the Iberian quest at the top here, you can see I have taken seven out of eight territories from him. One more battle will be that eighth one. So why don't we just go back there, and let's visit El Cid and see how he's doing. He hasn't been doing very well recently in the Valley of the Giants. So let's just jump in and see what we got. We got archers. Well, we don't have heavies, do we? Oh, no heavies. That's bad. Do we have any heavies in the second round? Nope. Oh, that kind of sucks for you. Time to turn the horsies loose. Okay, so that's what they have. All right, he does have horsies, so I have to do something about that. Let's see. You know, maybe I should just go with the... Um, I'm going to need heavies. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. Call them back. Call them back. Call them back. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put these guys up here so they can take care of the horsies. And I'm going to deploy my own horsies. Where are my horsies? Horsies. Okay, so I can also put down my crossbowmen. And I think what I'm going to do up the middle is I'll put these guys just so we have more heavies. Yeah, I could put down the trebuchet, but I just think that's a better idea. I do not believe I will need any special mercenary commanders for this. So let's go. Let's take the kitty cat and put him on the catapult. And we'll put... Yeah, don't, don't ever not have heavies. Yeah, the horsies just destroy anybody who doesn't have the uh, horsies. That's the... Oh, did I get wiped out? Oh, my heavies got wiped out. That's going to be a problem, isn't it? Okay, that's fine. We, we can work it out. We can work it out. Not going to spend any coins for this. I think we got this. Uh, this might be a problem for our buddies, though. Hold on a minute here. All right, you here, you here. I still have these guys, and these guys will help a lot. All right, so you over here, you. 
over here. All right, this could be um, problematic. So we'll see how this works out. I'm going to try to do this without any mercenary commanders. And of course, I don't have access to my infantry because I didn't put them in the first round. Yeah, let's go. All right, first things first. Take that out. Okay, Leonardus's guys up the middle. And done. And the horsies all lived. How about that? No, I should say two horsies died. Two horsies died. But you know, the crossbowmen, they're all okay. And most importantly, we have victory. Acquire. You're a loser. Move on. And I got a bunch of Viking spots. And we're going to scout a new location, Snowy Peaks. Maybe that's where he is. Let's see. What does he have here? He has stuff for me. Complete. Yes, you're a loser. Move on. Ooh, research. Okay, I have to get two more for him. All right, that's fine. See, that was a tricky one. He had cavalry, so I had to use my heavies. Otherwise, he would have gone right to the back and killed my crossbowmen. But I noticed he didn't have heavies, so I wanted to use my cavalry, and they work really good. It's just that, unfortunately, he did manage to kill my heavies. So, um, yeah, I didn't have a front line. But it worked out in the end. No mercenary commanders required. All right, now, the last thing I want to do here today, of course, has to do with wonders. We just got ourselves a bunch of extra gears, but I already had a lot of gears. How many? Well, now I have 6,888. And gee, which legendary blueprint is now available? Yes, that is Valhalla. Valhalla, if you look at it, boosts the damage of all your units and gives additional boost if you have extra palaces. And of course, you'll also get a wonderful little chest. And more importantly, you get a fourth commander slot. But if you can look at the situation that exists for me right now, what do I not have? I do not have that. I don't have the blueprint. I'm hoping we're going to get that right now. Because I can do three 10 rolls, and that's exactly what we're going to do. So I'm hoping I can get myself one of those Valhallas. So let's go. That's not the one that I want. Okay, I do have that one. That's not the one that I want. Let's try it again. This time, hopefully, we will get Valhalla. Let's go. It is legendary, so it's hard to get. But then again, I'm hoping. That's not what I want. That is also not what I want. Okay, well, I got two that time, but again, not what I want. And if you can see there, that's 30 of 80 that will guarantee you one. But you know what? I can only do 10 more rolls here. So let's go. Ah, oh, that is not what I want. How very disappointing. Yeah, those other ones are not useful to me at all. Oh, well. You have to spend a lot of them to get what you want. And I can't get that amazing look every time, can I? Oh, well, I will continue to save up gears, especially during this event. And I'm going to have to do some repair work over here. Did I, I don't. I did lose some horsies. I did lose some horsies. I did not lose any of my crossbowmen, though. Okay, so we have the Persian event. Basically, as I said, you complete these missions over here in order to advance. I might be able to do that one now. Let's just see this for a second here. 
because after all, I do have a lot of my troops. Let's see, because I have all of those. Here, hold it a second, put that up there. Put that one down there, put this one over here like this. And I do have all of the, uh, I could throw one of those out. And where are my crossbowmen? Oh, put that down there. Yeah, I mean, we have a good force here. We might be able to do this. Do I have enough room for... I mean, if I put this up here... No, I don't have enough. I was thinking, could I get the trebuchet in there somehow? No, I cannot. And he does not have heavies. It's too bad I can't get another set of horses in there. All right, let's see how this goes. There is a boss in there, though. That's important to remember. Okay, and we're going to put... Uh, actually, I'm going to put them there. Because I need to break through the line. Okay, let's say hi to the boss now. Here, have an elephant. Yeah, she's going down. All right, I do have to restore those troops, though. But it does mean I can advance a little bit now, can't I? All right, grab that. Spend research on wonders. I think collecting food is something I can probably do. I think I can do that by just doing... Where is it? This one right here. Ooh, was I just short? Yeah, just short. Uh, let's think about that for a moment. Uh, now we got it. Well, this one is fun. Collect 30 medium farm productions or collect 46 productions, which is clearly the one you want to do because you can just do the small ones that last about two or three minutes. Yeah, that's definitely the way to go with that one. That's going to be a little on the tedious side, so we're not going to do that right now. And I don't think... Ooh, I could actually do one of these. Yeah, why don't we just do one? Because why not? Because maybe I'll get 200 more. And I did. Okay, that was a good thing that I checked. All right, so that is really going to be it for today. Let me get out of here. So we got the Pershing event going right now. The important... Oh, the important thing about that is, of course, there's no merging. Yes, I kind of skipped the last event because I'm just not going to do the merging ones anymore. It just seems to be um, punitive at that point. It's kind of like working an eight-hour job to get money, but you can't get the money until you work another eight-hour job that's not going to give you anything but access to your money. Yeah, I just don't like that. Anyway, that's going to be it for now. We'll probably pop in on this again before the end, probably when there's uh, orbs for sale, and maybe take a look at the advancement in the event. I have actually been working on the Iberian Age one. As you can see, I'm doing the farms and the homes right now. And of course, I am working on the, uh, the Viking side as well. It is slow and tedious, though. I will say that. Anyway, that's going to be it for now, so thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it, and play games because games are fun. See ya!